was a few days ahead of the first week game of the season against Dundee. How do you feel pre-seasons went so far for us? I think it's been successful. Um, certainly enjoyed it. Um, top of the group in the cup. I think we'd have taken that, you know, good start. Um, scored goals, kept clean sheets. Um, so overall, yeah, happy and it's been it's been a good start. For yourself, you struggled at the start of last season with injuries, but you came back strong. Was it just a case this summer of making sure you came back and had a solid pre-season, which you seem to have done? Yeah, that's what I was desperate to do, you know. Um, come in, hit the ground running, and worked hard over the over the summer and then in pre-season as well. Um, and thanks to you know the staff here and everything, it's, it's been really good, and I'm feeling good. You seem to have formed a, an end of partnership with Paul Payton. You seem to be able to complement each other really well. Yeah, I think that as well. Um, I really enjoy playing with, with Pitts. Um, I think he helps me a lot, and and you know his experience is vital in our team. I, I feel obviously he's got the armband now, um, but no, he's a he's a real key, key member of the, of the squad as well. We spoke to you after the St Man game. It was a great start in the cup, and as you say, we went on to win the group. Is that the most pleasing thing that um, after getting that result, as we agreed, the pressure was kind of on us to go and beat the so-called lesser teams. We've been yeah. able to go and do that. Is that the most pleasing thing that we were able to turn up when the pressure was on? That's it. Yeah, um, they're not easy games. You know, the pressure's all on you. Um, but I thought we dealt with it really well. I think a couple of early goals in the games really helped us out. Um, Obviously, the slip up against Edinburgh City was disappointing, but the way that we we reacted the following Saturday was was brilliant, and we came out the traps flying here and, and got the early goal again, which really helped us. As you said, the two home games that we've had so far, we've scored ten goals, we haven't conceded, yeah. we're unbeaten. How important do you feel as a season to make East End Park a fortress and make teams concerned about coming here? Definitely, you know that's that's. Uh, one of the manager's main points, I think, at the very start, he wanted to make this a fortress and, you know, make sure everyone was together and, and so everyone got behind us, you know, we, we really want that. Um, and if teams, you know, teams should fear coming here, you know, we want it to be a fortress, as you say, and we don't want teams to come here and have it easy. We, we should be uh, controlling the games and, and that'll, that'll be the plan. For yourself, you this season particularly, um, you seem to be getting forward a lot. You obviously scored against St Man and then your goal on Saturday as well. So you must be pleased with your own form in that regard. Yeah, definitely. Um, a couple of goals, so delighted with that. But yeah, I've, obviously with Pates playing as well, he, he's a bit more defensive minded. So it allows me to, to bomb on and give me license to get forward, which I've really enjoyed. And, you know, I think I can do it. So hopefully, you know, it continues. You've said in interviews before how you'd love to add more goals to your games. You've said I've done that at the start of this season, but you probably haven't scored a better one than what you did on Saturday. No, yeah, I was caught quite sweet. Uh, as soon as I hit it, I thought, yeah, that's that's gone in. So I was uh, happy, as you say. But yeah, other boys, you know, Nizzy's banging them in, and you know, Dallas is setting setting goals up, and everyone's contributing. So it's nice, even as a chipping in with a goal. So it's it's good because. The goals are coming from uh, from every angle. How good is it that we're playing one of the favourites for the title at, right in the first game of the season? Does it give us a, a chance to test ourselves straight away, do you feel, rather than maybe easing ourselves out in the league against some of the so-called lesser teams? I think it's the best way to start. Um, I know I'm looking forward to it, all the boys are looking forward to it. Um, be a great one Friday night under the lights on the telly. Um, just a great way to start, so be a good test for us, see where we're at. Um, so, can't wait. As you say, it's on the TV, so obviously shows that there's a bit of interest in the game. Obviously shows that despite us having maybe a poorer season than we all wanted last year, that people still respect them from as a club and expect us to do well this season, give them the challenge. So, is that a compliment to us, the squad that we've put together, and, and um, you know, it kind of shows the ambition that we have for this season? Absolutely, yeah. Um, Probably turned a few heads, you know, the St Mirren game and, and the others, the others, you know. So and that's what we wanted to do. You know, we've got good players, um, good team, good staff. You know, we're we're confident, um, but we know that you know there's a lot of hard work ahead and, and a lot of work to be done. Friday night under the night under the lights, like you said. So hopefully a, a good crowd turns out for the first game of the season. Definitely, yeah. Hopefully it'll be a, a good crowd and get right behind us and you know feed off the energy. It's it's. Uh, it's important, like it's it's a nice feeling, and when everyone gets behind the boys and and everyone's together, it's uh, it's amazing. Like it's nothing like it.